guys, how you doing? It's Henry at Mowers and Blowers. Good morning. Welcome to another weekend product review. I've got another box in the mail. I'm gonna open it up and show you exactly what it is. Uh, this is a 15,000 milliamps per hour, solar powered, Wi-Fi, non-wired, um, security surveillance spotlight camera that also pans 360 degrees. Uh, it's from INQ Mega or NQ Mega. I've received a few uh, NQ Mega products over the past uh, year or two, and uh, I've got security cameras all around my house. As you can see, I've got uh, two security cameras that are wired that go into a hard drive. And then I have another kind that's similar to this, where it's also a spotlight. So at night, when you walk by, it detects motion, gives you a notification on your phone that something's moving in this general region. Spotlights come on, right? And uh, also capture exactly who's walking through this door. So it's very useful. That one on the bottom there is wired. This one's all self-contained. It's, you don't need to wire anything through your house. You don't have to drill holes to run the wire through to connect to a power source. This is a solar panel one. So it has a solar panel on it where you can detach from the uh, device itself and place the solar panel in an area where sun will be able to charge the device. Uh, for me though, I think um, my area is so open that you could also just mount the solar panel on the device itself mount the device wherever you need that region to be surveyed. So I've just attached the solar panel onto the device itself. It, it allows you to pivot to point it towards wherever the sun is. Again, if you didn't have sun where the device was gonna be, you can remove the panel and it actually comes with a long wire that connects to the device and onto the solar panel as well as some additional mounting hardware and also a swivel bracket where you would attach the solar panel onto the bracket and you could attach the bracket to wherever the sun is visible to be able to charge your device. It has some uh, instructions which I never read because I have so many surveillance cameras that I'm an expert at installing. This is a bracket where you would drill holes into where you wanted the device to be mounted and then this slips right onto it and you have these side screws that you can attach it to. So it's all self-contained in one. Again, this is a solar powered, batteries uh, inside. Uh, you need an SD card, micro SD, which you would place right in here, which I just put a 32 gigabyte uh, SD, micro SD card in there to uh, record basically any intruders or activity from what it picked up. Uh, that's not included, so you have to go and buy one. Uh, here's the side pod spotlights that when they, it senses there's motion or an intruder, these lights will come on to warn them to get out. Uh, this does pan up and down and left and right. And here's the sensor. We can remove this uh, protective film for shipping purposes. It also has a microphone where from your phone, you could hear what's going on over there. And in turn also have a microphone where you can press a button on your phone, talk into it and communicate to the person or thing that's in that area. Like, hey, get out of here, you know? Very, very useful. So I downloaded the U-Box app and basically you just have to register for an account using an email and your own password. You enter your Wi-Fi information in here, you add the device, the instructions are very clear, you scan the QR code on the instructions and it pairs itself, the device to your phone. And once that happens, you could see the screen, you tap the screen and you could pan left, right, up, down. You can adjust the notifications, the sensitivity level, um, standard definition or high definition, all kinds of different settings that you can read inside the uh, manual. 
So what we're gonna do right now is it's been paired very easily. I've had a lot of these things before. Sometimes it's a pain in the butt to pair, but this paired right away and I could see it and the responsiveness is very good and up and down and my Wi-Fi is gonna be a high signal because where I wanna mount this is right near my router where all the signal comes out of. So it's gonna be perfect. I have one place that I need to mount this because it's not covered around my house because the camera that I have there has conked out over the years. I had it for about a year with the rain and the heat and all that stuff, all of a sudden one day it stopped working. So I'm gonna mount this where the old holes were. So here we're uh, in the backyard near my shed. And uh, this camera here hasn't worked in about six months. And this one is magnetic ones. I'm just gonna pull it off. I'm gonna take this black thing off, try to expose the holes. I'm not sure, I don't remember how I put it on there. But then I'll drill uh, the plate on there and we'll try to mount this camera where this camera used to be. This camera doesn't work anymore. So we're gonna install it right now onto the uh, house. guys see I've installed it and the Sun is right there so the Sun is charging my device on the device as you can see you can see me can you guys see that all right so you can let me do this so you can see better You can pan and go up and down. There, you can see me a little better now. It's so sunny out. Oops, wrong way. There we go. You see that? So here we go. You see me right there. I'm at my camera and I'm pointing at the gate where I want it to be. There's a microphone here that you could press and you could hear it. There's a slight delay, but you could talk to somebody that's in the backyard. There's a slight delay but you could talk to so somebody that's, that's in the backyard. And then you could talk into the microphone there and you could hear it on their phone. So that's in the backyard. And then you could talk into the microphone there and you could hear it on their phone. Like I said, there's a delay, but it works pretty clear. So in the backyard. And then you could talk into the microphone there and you could hear it on their phone. Like I said, there's a delay, but it works pretty clear. So there you go. Now this side of my house is covered by a panning camera. That's 360 degrees up, down, left, and right. It's got a spotlight on there so that when any movement comes over here at night, the spotlight turns on, notifies me that there's something going on in this region on my phone. And I'll be able to capture exactly what's going on recorded onto my phone with the SD card. That's not included. Uh, it's powered by the sun. I didn't run any wires anywhere. Uh, if you wanted to move that panel to, let's say, on the right side of the house to capture the sun better, it includes that long wire, which you can connect the solar panel onto a bracket, onto the device to power it. But it's self-contained, it's Wi-Fi. I don't need uh, a 4G or a 5G card or anything like that. You just mount it, pair it to your phone, and you're good to go with a security camera that's uh, 15,000 milliamps per hour battery, lithium ion battery in it. So uh, very cool from uh, Incumega. Thanks a lot for sending it to me. And uh, it's exactly what I needed. We'll see you guys next time on Mowers and Blowers. See you next time on Mowers and Blowers. 
Hey, if you guys enjoyed the video, remember to give me a like. Also, comment below. Subscribe. Remember, it doesn't cost anything to subscribe. It's free, right? Also, hit that little bell. That way you'll get post notifications whenever there's a new video and you won't miss out on any of them. Remember to follow my Instagram and Facebook, as well as if you'd like to donate a dollar or two, paypal.me slash mowers and blowers. Really appreciate all the support. Also, to keep the videos coming every day, support the channel. Bye.